Hi guys and welcome to my time for a change update. Um, today is our second update. Um, so yeah I don't really feel like I have that much to update you guys on but I'm just going to roll through the questions and answer them all for you and then yeah okay so number one um is reminding you of what my goals are um so my goals were um to cut back on sugar and bread um question number two have i been sticking to my goals um no <laughs> basically for the last week anyway i've been really bad with sugar um i've been i'm still really good with bread um I've only had it twice when I've been out, um, like at a cafe. I've had, um, I think it's like ciabatta bread or something like that. Um, so I've had that twice. But other than that, I haven't had any at home or anything like that. So that's really good. But I haven't been as good with my sugar at all. So, yes that's not good um number three what were the worst and best moments so far um so sorry there's a train going past yes anyway um worst moments probably um once again an event or party I had my baby shower last weekend um, and I wasn't actually too bad I didn't even really eat that much but yeah that would have been the worst day I would say um, and the best moment would be um, just that I'm still going so well with not eating um, bread as much so yeah that's good uh question number four something i have learned um i have learned that it's difficult to um well i guess it's probably not but um I have found it difficult to be um, eating healthy or trying to eat healthier when it's not just me that I cook for. Um, we live with my pa my husband's mum at the moment and so we cook for her as well and so and she likes all that bad stuff so trying to yeah I don't know trying to cook f for me and her when we're eating when we're wanting to eat two very different things is difficult I find yeah um number five show or share where you are now I weigh 90.7 so um yeah 90.7 that is my weight at the moment number six how are you feeling about your progress I'm feeling pretty good um so from the last um, I can't actually remember, 
sorry my baby brain is crazy but I'm just sort of like going off the weights from my midwife appointments because they happen at the same time have been happening at the same time each fortnight um so the last one I had I was yeah 90.7 and the one before that the fortnight before that I was 90.2 so I've only put on 500 grams so I'm really happy about that because I am pregnant so I do still want my baby to be growing um but I for whatever reason am not um don't seem to be putting on a lot of weight myself so I'm really happy about that hopefully the baby can just suck it all out of me and then after he's out I can just get into it so yeah my question seven will you be making any changes to your goal or plans for reaching your goal I am not I'm trying not to be too hard on myself I have cut back a lot on my sugar and I'm happy with that at the moment I'm okay with the fact that I haven't gone completely sugar free or anything like that um, but I am taking small steps to be cutting back further and further each time uh, each day so yeah I'm really happy with that um, and I as I said last time I will be upping my game once I have had the baby but for now I do sort of need to take it easy um, I am wanting to sort of do some walking but I've been in a lot of pain lately um, in my lower back and my um, like lower stomach abdomen whatever you call it region um, and I've just got a smiley belt that has just arrived today so I'm hoping that I can chuck that on and it's going to make a little bit of a difference so I can maybe get out and do some walking um, but I won't be trying to run a marathon or anything like that just casual walk around the block every day or so I think would be good especially when I can fit it in because this weather is crap at the moment um, but yeah um, also I did just want to say for like whatever reason I'm not sure I sort of have just like pretty much lost my appetite entirely um, which is kind of worrying me being pregnant and all but um, my midwife seems to be happy with everything with baby so that's good but I um yeah I just usually I'll get up and have breakfast because I just have breakfast when I'm making the kids breakfast and then sometimes I just won't I won't eat again until I don't know I, I can't even remember sometimes some days I can't even remember if I've eaten at all but I'm not feeling hungry or anything so I don't know it's really weird usually I would be like starving and feeling sick um, if I haven't eaten but yeah lately tch, nothing so yeah I don't know but um, I did actually end up in hospital for a few or well, like half of the day slash night um, last week because I just had this horrible migraine and I had blurry eyes and I couldn't talk properly and my face and my nose and my hands were all numb and tingling and it was really freaking me out and I yeah I just wasn't making any sense to people I was trying to text and I was trying to talk to people in person and it made no sense and everyone was looking at me like I was insane so I did end up going to up to the hospital 
to the maternity ward and I was there for quite some time and they did a lot of tests and things um, but they couldn't really figure out what it was um, so they just put it down to um, just like a really bad migraine um, but when they were sort of asking me questions about trying to figure out what was wrong um, they asked me if I had eaten anything different or like overly sugary or anything like that and I the only thing that I had eaten that day was breakfast as far as I could remember so I don't know maybe that I think maybe that might have triggered the migraine a bit or something like that I don't know I'd still been drinking a lot of water and everything so it wasn't like a dehydration thing or anything but yeah I don't know maybe the food lack of food was a cause of it I don't know but yeah so I have been trying to just make sure I am eating something but I find it really hard to force myself to eat if I'm not hungry yeah so yeah I don't know if that's anything to be worried about or anything but that I think that's probably why I haven't been um, putting on more weight so yeah that's all I have to update you guys on today um, so don't forget to go and check out all the other girls in the collabs um, playlists I will have them all linked down below in the description box and don't forget to comment and give them all some encouragement I think they're all doing pretty well so that's awesome don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already so you don't miss out on any future videos and I will see you guys in my next one bye